and welcome back to the Weekly Insight with John Plaza. There is more and more talk about Generation Z, you know, people born between 95 and 2010. And one still hears a lot about millennials born between 82 and 2004 or Generation Y. However, no one talks about Generation X, the people born between 1965 and 1981. They are in charge today and will reign, financially anyway, for years to come. Some even call them the lost generation. But before we bury them, let's analyze an unusual investment opportunity. Born between 1961 and 1981, this generation is entering the prime of its life. They make up the majority of senior business executives and are also leaders and entrepreneurs and startup founders who know how to attract venture capital. Members of Generation X choose to work reasonable hours on the conditions that take into account family life. This generation has accounted difficulty in finding permanent and well-paid jobs. According to a study by Switzerland Federal Statistic Office, Generation X constitutes 36.2% of the working population, followed by millennials who make up a third of the workforce. According to a Deloitte study, Generation X investors are expected to almost quadruple their asset to $22 trillion by 2030, compared to 11 trillion for millennials. It is interesting to note that Generation X is the most in-depth of all generations. In the digital age, Gen Xer rely heavily on the web for advice on personal finance. Gen Xer are most concerned about retirement, 21%, followed by saving, 13%, and digital currency, 13% we can see that the sandwich generation aspect is also reflected in the investments with technological investment on one hand and long-term investment on the other. This generation is a great investment opportunity. So don't hesitate to ask our expert what asset and or product to bet on. Thank you very much. Have a great week, stay safe, and keep on winning. 